Hey guys, it's Rachel and I just filmed another video, hence why I'm in Decora. Um, and I just wanted to show you what I got recently. I've been very depressed recently. And my way of trying to make myself better is by buying stuff. So this is going to be a haul of recent stuff. So I've got Hub Japan, um, BT21, Boohoo and random bits and bobs from Depop and shopping services so stay tuned for that so first I'm just gonna do boohoo real quick I did get a purple skirt and I have no idea where it is at this moment of time so I will just add a picture here I love it it's so cute and it was 20 pounds but I mean the quality's there so that's not too bad and I got this little top that says nope which I, I'm down for anything that has something vaguely negative on it, <laughs> um, but it's still cute, so <laughs> that's just me. <laughs> then I just got this pale blue skirt. I am in love with skirts like this at the moment. I went through a phase of just wearing skater skirts and now it's kind of like e-line kind of button skirts type of thing, like denim ones. Um, this is a little bit thin, but it's still cute. It was less than... Ten pounds, so that's not too bad. This one was in the sale. I, I took a risk with this, but I, I'm keeping it. And it's PVC and a lilac, which is everything. And it's just a simple bodycon skirt with this little frilly bit at the top. I love this. I don't have the confidence right now to wear it, but hopefully I will. <laughs> Up is everything I got. I have Japan. So I'm going to start with my first purchase, which is this adorable cap from Miss Lou to you. I will link her shop below. From Jeannie J is this rosette which I am actually in love with. This is so relevant to me. This belongs in Harajuku and it's, I love rosettes, it's so pretty. Then from Hoshi Candy I got these sticker places. Not, you can't really see them in the bag. But trust me they're there and those are the designs i got these mainly to focus mainly to put in resin charms for personal use not for my shop but who knows could club i bet all of these i had all of these over the weekend that's so bad isn't it this green tea mochi balls and i got these little i love melon pan if you're new here I freaking love melon pan, okay? And it's hard to get a hold of unless I'm in London. And I got these mini, mini ones. I mean, like, I'm gonna have to show you because it's freaking adorable. Look at the baby melon pan. It's a baby melon pan. How cute is this? The only thing with it is that it tastes a bit melony. Like, actually, melons. <laughs> It's not my favourite flavour in the world, I'll be honest with you, but I don't know, they're cute. So Haichu were giving out free stuff because they are actually a UK company now, so where did I do that? <laughs> yeah, all the Haichu. Uh, what else? Oh, this is actually from Tesco's, but I need to show you guys because I have been after this for so long. I've been looking for this and it's the pink Kit Kat guys. It tastes a little bit different to normal um, Kit Kat, but you know, it's, it's nice. I like it and it, it's pink. <laughs> Go Then I have taken this out of the package, like the big package. I only got this for the little toy, if I'm quite honest with you. It's Henry. It had good atom on it, but I know it wasn't going to be good at all. I mean, it could have been. But it's the other little yellow friend. And it's this little pompon. And it's meant to kind of sit on the pack. Go on, you fuck. But I stupidly thought it would sit on a glass of water, you know? Like this, but then it just fell straight in. So I don't know what I'm gonna put on it, but put it on. Oh art box I got this this is the only cloven item I got I'm very surprised it's a John but it's summer but you know oh well it's my melody I love this so much it's kind of got like a vintage feel to it and how cute is those sleeves I love 
love it. So cute. I still haven't tried it on now. It's bad, isn't it? So at Artbox, they did a kind of um, lucky dip thing. Like, they often do it at Sanrio stores in Japan, where you buy a raffle ticket and you win every single time kind of thing. Um, so for four pounds, I did the four pound one twice, and I got this, which is super nice. That's a bargain for four pound, isn't it? It's very sturdy, and I have no idea what I'm going to use it for, but it's cute. This I'm probably going to give away. Um, I really want to do a giveaway when I reach 10,000 subscribers on YouTube. Fingers crossed I'll actually get there, but this is going to be one of the prizes. I'm kind of collecting like little bits and bobs as I go along, so I don't have to fork out like hundreds of pounds of stuff, you know? Like, well, who knows how big it's going to be, you know? I don't know. Anyway. It's super super pretty. It's a notepad with a pencil bar. It's, it's precious, but I, I just have too many notepads so. And also I really wanted to get some chopsticks because I only really have one pair I like, which is my Good at Summer ones. And I often eat um, cup noodles at work, especially when I can't be bothered to make my own lunch. Uh, so these are gonna live in my locker at work. Little twin stars. Super cute. Then at uh, Tofu Cute, I wanna say. I think I think it's Tofu Cute. I got this little bunny clip. Super handy for like packets of crisps and stuff, and then I got this little alpaca. And then I got this little panda. How freaking cute is he? Oh, squishy but beanie. I love him. And I think that was actually everything. I got a Hyper Japan. So next up is going to be Depop stuff. So I recently got this. I thought it'd be so perfect for decor records. So it says, shut up. <laughs> Again, borderline offensive kind of negative thing, so it's still cute. Is this awful? Let me show it. It's originally from Punky Pins, but yeah, I just found it. I can't remember what I searched for actually. Ah, uh, these shoes. I okay, I've got two pairs of shoes, and I have been after both of them for so long, so long. So these I ended up paying a little bit more for than. I mean, like. I am fierce do a lot of sales, but these are these are still cheaper than retail price, so it's not too bad. And they were in my size. I don't often wear red, but I just love these so much, and I think it'd be perfect because I do have a few things like pink things with cherries on it, red cherries. So I figured I I need these for those kind of occasions, you know. And it's kind of a bit more dainty classy of me rather than my normal kind of sporty I don't even know like street wear I don't know these wee box showing my favorite color lilac I think I think lilac's my favorite color I actually don't know um and they're very you can take these off and I just yeah they're like pretty boring shoes minus this and obviously the color so next up, um, oh I've got one thing from AliExpress. I have ordered other things but they're coming to me. Also I've got another Milkland jumper coming to me. <laughs> it's bad. I, I already have the mint and pink cotton candy sweaters and I've got the lilac one on the way which is, my collection is complete as far as I'm concerned. It's nine pounds, it's very thin but I mean it's perfect for summer. And it's pretty much free size. I do need to give it a iron. And then shopping service stuff. So most of this is going to be PT21 stuff. Apart from this. So this is... Where is it? I have a feeling this is originally from WC or Wago. But I've been eyeing this up for quite a while as well. And I finally found it. I took a bit of a risk because I wasn't sure how it's going to fit but it, it does fit. It's stretchy but 
it's not going to go much bigger than my size, you know. Just a simple pleated skirt and tartan. I have no idea what on earth that's going to go with, but so guys, are you ready for my little BT21 haul? So I love BTS. I love, I mean, I don't love line, but I used to use line camera a lot to edit all of my Instagram pictures. I still do, um, just not as much. And you know, they collabed and it was perfect. I love it. I love it. So I have two tops which are literally the same, but they've got different characters on and prints. So this one, new with tags. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's black, but I need it. So this one's got Cookie and Shooky on it, which is John Cook's and Sugar's characters. And then this one has got Cola. Can't, I always say this wrong. I'm so stupid. Cola, which is Ratman or RM's. Character. So it's, I love this so much. This is my favourite. Like I love this. So the top, the sleeves are pretty long on it. It also has like a slit in the bottom, and it's longer on the back. Just for reference, if you're gonna buy it. And then we have. This, can you tell? These are my favourites. I do love Mang as well. I love. Actually, no. Mang is probably my favourite. I don't know. Um, I just got these. I picked this up on Depop, and then this was from Shopping Service. It's still got the plastic wrap on it, but you know, I'm not sure whether I want to take them out yet or not. Um, and then today I got these off a of Facebook seller. I've got some RJ socks, which are Jin's character, super super cute, and then also come with a pair that just black bt21 i would love if this was pink or purple or even anything pastel i would love this but i needed them i actually love like these style of um the socks i love wearing them with my feeler disruptors i friggin love those shoes so much and then the last thing i got some unofficial stickers which i thought would be absolutely perfect to put on a suitcase, which I do need to buy some new ones because mine got so battered when I went to Japan and Korea uh, that I do really need some new ones. So these, I mean, I'm pretty sure they're just like printed off and you know, it's, it's like quite a nice paper. Oh God. Get a mang, RG, cola, oh, whoa, shooky, tata. Cookie and Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. I love him. I mean, Jimmy is probably my bias, but I don't know. It's because it's yellow. That's why I'm not a massive fan of it. But yeah, that was <laughs> everything. I think. I don't know. Who knows? I I buy quite a bit of stuff. I really shouldn't. I am constantly clearing shit out because I have no room. This is only. Half of my wardrobe, if you're curious as to where the hell I keep everything. Um, and I am constantly trying to clear stuff out because I, if I have all my clothes in there, I literally cannot move it. Literally can't, it's so bad. But yeah, I, I needed this stuff to try and make me happy. Can anyone else relate? I'm sure, I'm sure there's plenty that can relate. Oh, it's a pain because, yeah, I feel sad. So I'm gonna buy stuff and then it's just like, oh, I have no money. Oh, that makes me even more depressed, so. Yeah, <laughs> fucking life. Yay, depression, what a fucking brilliant idea that was.